major distribution Yeah, those children all my dear friend No, wait, no, 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 I'm talking about Drake I'm talking about Drake, not me, no Good morning, everyone. What are we, 160 episodes in? 159, something like that. Hope you guys are having a great morning. Agenda right now is that we're heading to work at the gym, of course, and that's pretty much, that's pretty much, that's pretty much the day today. If there was any day that I would have to sleep early, it would have to be tonight because I got work tomorrow bright and early in the morning. We also got a, uh, well, I'll just talk about it tomorrow, so let's save that for tomorrow's agenda, ladies and gentlemen. So, dude, the weather is so up and down this week. I think in the beginning of the week, it was like, it was about like 65 degrees cloudy. Now it's cloudy, but it's 80 degrees out. Can we get a W in the chat, please? Kiddos, kiddos, why, why is my camera at 41%? Already? What is, what is going on? Let me let me fill you up here real quick. Pause. By the way, boys, done with work now. I think I mentioned earlier that uh, I, I got work tomorrow uh, early in the morning. However, this time, your boy pulled a couple of strings for this not to happen anymore. Um, so I don't have work tomorrow. So that means I can actually leave early for the for the Filipino gathering that Charlie's mom is holding up. You excited for it? You know, it's been a while since I've seen the brother. Well, to be fair, I'm going to see him next week anyway gonna have a sleepover at their place hopefully if i can because uh the shoot happens at detroit lakes again the the lake shirt shoot to save some gas i think uh i think i'd rather just sleep over there yesterday's episode i didn't really sing much so uh this time we're gonna catch up a little bit all right the singing haters are like ah no not again no 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 more singing please all the no more no more hey it's the tattoo right here boys all that i need is you all that I ever need Just like the day that I met you The day I thought forever Perfect that I'm saying this in the rain right now It fits the mood, you know what I'm saying? There it is again You know what, let's sing some sad songs, not Girlfriend He's never been on this side before. This perfectly fits the theme because uh, it's raining right now, of course. And, uh, you know, we're going to be singing some sad songs in the rain. I'm fine, I swear. <laughs> Your boy had zero direction for this video, so I, I just decided, you know what? Let's do a little singing video with a little bit of uh, Peter patter from the, from the rain in the background. So what sad songs should we sing, guys? That I just want you to know I found no reason for me Because tonight will be the night that I will fall for you over again Don't make me change my mind Fun fact, today's actually the longest day of the year So the sun is out the longest, June 21st Kind of ironic how <laughs> like today was pretty much cloudy the whole time So I can't really get to experience the longest day of the year Which kind of sucks You know what that means, right? This is such like a pessimistic way of looking at it Every time I think about the longest day of the year It's like, it's downhill from here That's kind of, I guess on the other side of the coin For the shortest day of the year I look at it pretty optimistically Everything else after the shortest day of the year Is, you know, the, the opposite Like it, it, it it's only up from here. I don't know. I just went at a ramble there, but, but fortunate for us, we still got like the whole summer ahead of us. So I'm like, it, it's all good. And honestly, I won't really see a difference until like August or like September, you know, or like when the time changes. So I'm, I'm not, I'm not too worried about it. I think last week was like the official like first day of the summer. So we're in summer, boys. It doesn't feel like it, but you know, we're, we're in summer nonetheless. Kind of crazy to think about how like in two weeks the fair's coming up. It's like, whoa, or is it? No, it's not. No, oh my God, no, it's not. I think the first day of the fair is June 28th or something like that. It's like, whoa, gotta get some content out of it, I guess. You know, there's a little bit of content. I don't know if they're gonna have like different rides and stuff, but if they do, then it's gonna be a lot more fun. I actually wanna get mic'd up for that type of video though. If I find someone that can hold my camera, the vlogs for the fair are gonna feel a lot different. We'll get to it when it gets there. We'll, you know, we'll talk about it when it gets there. What I'm disappointed about though, is like, I've been kind of talking about, I was talking about this like a couple months ago where please have like an unlimited pass. It turns out they do have an unlimited pass, but for <laughs> for three days. <laughs> well, it's not an unlimited pass. I guess it's a, it's a three day pass and it's like 70 bucks each. And I'm like, bro, 
really? It really taxing us out here, dude. And for the three day pass, it's $70. So there's no way. For three weeks, I'm gonna be spending $210, bro. That's crazy tough. That's only assuming I'm gonna be going there every day, which I can guarantee you I'm not gonna go there every day, you know? Maybe, maybe not. Again, you know, we'll get to it when it gets there. Either way, we're gonna be hitting leg day now. I'm gonna push myself pretty decently here. When I get there, I'll probably have about an hour, an hour and 10 minutes, something like that. I might try some deadlifts, but you know, I'll do squats, leg extensions, leg curls, all that kind of stuff. The, the basics. And then if I have enough time, we'll see if I want to do some deadlifts. Who knows? I'm actually taking my progressive overload seriously again. With squats, I can do over two plates. The first time I did two plates, I'm like, whoa, this is actually not too bad. This is like almost easy. That's partly because I never really did it and I never really pushed myself as much as like I should be when it comes to adding more weight to my to my lifts. Now that I see that there's actually like I have a potential of getting up there even even more i'm just gonna keep progressively overloading you know Jesus. you know i always have to give praises to the most high that uh during my car accident we didn't get injured badly like all i'm saying is that you know there, there was no need for an ambulance there was no need for any medical attention we were okay seeing others like that you know I, I wish them all the best back there and i hope you know I, I hope everything's okay but it's a blessing that i you know we we weren't seriously injured or even injured really it was just an injury to the bank account you know what i'm saying thank god our health is still okay you know coming out of an accident like it's always it's it's it makes you feel for the people that get into accidents even more to me i always feel for the people that get into car accidents like that but like or any car accidents really and i always feel for them but after experiencing one like firsthand it's like whoa life could just end like that you know what i mean i feel like that was like a sign that like hey i should be even more careful and it was kind of like a warning sign to me how i should be more uh diligent when driving because you never know what could happen and it's not even just like car accident related stuff it's it's also just in general you know i don't know if this is about to turn into a talk about like appreciation here but always appreciate like the any moment man like whatever you're going through uh, appreciate that you're you're alive appreciate that you're you're breathing you're living you know in my situation even looking back like i'm glad that i went through the tough situations i'm glad that i went through like tough mental struggles because it led me to like who i am now so yeah those are the two like things to take away from this video if anything is that like you know i, I appreciate appreciate living make sure to you know live your life as the best that you can because you know it could end at any moment and also like appreciate going through tough struggles and appreciate um tough times because when you're going through tough times that that's the time that you really get to make moves in your life it, it's like a reality check you know what i mean because as we all know you know the world's cold man like it's not it's not sunshines and rainbows there's there's a little bit of thunder a little bit of tornado a little bit or a little bit of hurricanes whatever natural disaster you want to put this analogy with appreciate life appreciate the loved ones and in my situation appreciate what life throws at me use that as like uh, a boost to even greater things because at the end of a storm there's always you know sunshines you know you gotta make sure to get through that storm first you know i don't know it's my little talk i guess there's not a star in heaven that we can read major distribution yeah those children all my dear for it no wait no 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 i'm talking about drake i'm talking about drake not me no if you like have a secret little rendezvous If you like to do the things you know that we shouldn't do Baby, I'm perfect Baby, I'm perfect for you Riz or Harisman is the question of the day Damn, baby that, Yeah, that's Harisman It won't matter Ah uh. I just took a DNA test, turns out I'm one other person. That bitch. This one is for the boys with the boom assist. I'm top down AC with the cool assist. I get this feeling, and every time we kiss, I swear I can fly. I want this to last. Need you by my side, cause every time we touch. Alright, well, I'm over.